I do not sell and I do not promote the products in this video. This video is based on my own opinion and this video is for educational purpose only. Strictly not for under 21 years old below. Lastly, this video is not for Malaysia. Ta -da! Welcome back to the reviews guys. So in this video about this next gen, uh, which is the Beep Bar. So they got 10 types of flavors. But before I start to review, I'm gonna tell you all, please, please, please. This is really important for these videos. It's not suitable for 21 years old below. And in these videos, I'm not selling, I'm not promoting, I'm just doing vid reviews. So without wasting our time, let's just get into more closer. All right guys, first thing first, let's just take a look about this nicely designed device, okay, which is a next gen Beep Bar. So uh, right here, it's like got a button, but it's not a button. All right, so but there is a button right here. So very special for this device. When you press one time, okay, it will pop up the light, the backlight, uh, backlit or backlight. Okay, so right here they got indicates the uh, battery milliamp, which is still got eighty one percent left. Okay, and then the wattage is at right here twelve watt, and then this is the liquid indicator. 100% because I changed the new flavor. I tried the new flavor. So another thing is uh, at the bottom right here, they got highlight this mesh A 1.2 ohm, 0 0.6 ohm, mesh B. Okay, so you press this uh, button two times, twice, one, two, like this. So it will change to uh, 0 0.6 ohm. It will highlight to 0 0.6 ohm, mesh B, right? So currently right now is 18 watt. And then you press twice again, it will change to mesh A, mesh B, 0.6 ohm, 25 watt. So you press again, it will show you that you are using the mesh A and 1.2 ohm, not the 0.6 ohm, like this. Okay, 12, 18, and 25 watt. Ah. And at the bottom right here, the airflow system is very, very functional. And this is the detachable device. Very nice design. They got the magnets and pin, and it's very tight. See, and at the top, you can hang your lanyard as well, as usual. So basically, this device, simple and elegant, and also the most important thing is the flavor. So right now, uh, this is the flavor, just only the flavor. The one that I'm using right now is this berry yogurt. Okay, and then they got this mango passion, and then they got this double mango, which is I want to try. And then for this one, it's a grape crystal and then Ribena lychee. So this is just only the flavor which is they send me and then they do send me the kit set as well. So this is how the kit set looks like. For the kit set, I received the honeydew melon, taro ice cream, watermelon lychee, solero lime, and also last but not least, strawberry. Still got one card, next gen big bar. And then uh, remove the sticker, they, they teach you all the instruction. <laughs> I received the keychain as well. Actually for this next gen uh, keychain, very, very nice. I'm not sure where can I print this keychain. Nice, right? I like this type of accessory, you know. And also they got extra, send me the lanyard. Elevate your sense, big bar. So guys, this is all the flavor that I wanna try. Okay, so first thing, the device just unbox. There is a sticker at the bottom and then at the side right here. And then at the top, there's a silicone as well. Make sure you open everything and then you snap back the device. So press five times. For this device, you can switch off as well. One, two, three, four, five, like this. And it turns on, okay? One, two, three, four, five turns off. One, two, three, four, five, turn on. One time, backlight, and then twice to adjust the uh, wattage, okay? In between 12, 18, and also 25 watt. So all of the flavor I will be trying in 25 watt. Open full airflow, okay? Full airflow. So guys, now is the time for reviewing the flavor. The first flavor that I want to try, okay, I just let you know the honeydew melon. Let's just try the honeydew melon. By the way, I will sensor right here, so it's good for everyone, okay? Let's just try and see. Honeydew melon. Wow. It's quite smooth, all right? So uh, talking about the honeydew melon, first thing, it's quite smooth, very, very smooth flavor. You get a little bit harsh and then smooth flavor. Uh, talking about the sweetness, actually you can taste the sweetness. Instead of the flavor profile, they got add on a little bit of the sweetness as well, but not very, not over sweet. Honeydew melon, exactly you'll taste melon inside, all right, instead of honeydew. So about the coldness, actually there is a mean, a little bit mean inside, not much, but you can definitely feel the cold. Ah, it's not brain freeze, those type, okay? So for me, for this flavor, honeydew melon, not bad, not bad. Another flavor, which is a double mango, snap inside. So when you snap inside, automatically the light will pop up, right? Okay, 25 watt. Let's just try half airflow. 
let's see what's the difference in between half airflow and full airflow, okay? See, this is a one dot of airflow. This is two dot of, of airflow. So let's just try one dot. Okay, it's empty air fill, full wide open airflow. Let's just try and see. Even though there is only a very small dot in between one dot and two dot, it makes a very huge changes. Ah, very, very different. Even the vapor production is different. Flavor, you also can feel a little bit different. But overall for this double mango, what I can feel is cold, okay, not very cold, but it's way more sweeter than the honeydew melon. The one that I tried this honeydew melon. It's way more sweeter. So uh, you can definitely taste a little bit of soury and also sweetness together with the mango, rich mango flavor. A little bit of creaminess at the end uh, because I don't know why, got a little bit of creamy at the end, just a little bit, uh, the end taste, okay? So this one is also mango, but it's mango passion. Double mango, and also this mango passion. Totally different category, even though they both got mango inside. So maybe passion, they will give you some kind of taste, like a very sour taste because it's a passion fruit. So they mix and match a little bit. They combine this mango passion together. So it will feel that not very creamy mango and not very sour passion inside. So for me, for this mango passion, they're very clever in controlling the coldness. All right, not very cold. It stays at the more than average, okay? More than 50% of the coldness, okay? And for me, this mango passion is definitely a all day vape flavor. So the next one, which is uh, this watermelon lychee, let's just try and see. Okay, one thing special, Right now, I don't know how they make this device, okay? So if this flavor is new, mango passion, this is a battery. This is the flavor, so it's separate. Uh, so right now, the flavor for this mango passion, I just unboxed just now. It still got 100% of the liquid indicator it shows right here. So this is the flavor that I use for around three days, watermelon lychee. So when you pop in, it will detect and it will indicate 95% of the liquid remains. Quite special, right? Special. How did they even know because it's a separate? Or is it this flavor inside got a chip set? Ma? Special. The most smoothest among all that I tried these five flavors. Still got another five flavor left, okay? So among all these uh, berry yogurt, honeydew melon, double mango, and mango passion, for this watermelon lychee, definitely feel a little bit more smoother. Uh, smoother, smoother. Watermelon inside. Lychee, you definitely can taste as well, okay? So they mix together these two flavor, not very cold. It's cold as well, but not very cold. Sweetness decreased a little bit, comparison with the double mango. So for this flavor, is also A+. Okay, so the last one that I want to try is this berry yogurt. This, you will definitely feel a little bit of the, like a yogurt taste, creamy taste a little bit, but it's still a cold flavor, all right? Yum, yum. Berries taste very less. Don't too much berries. So if too much berries, you feel overwhelmingly rich in your mouth, so you cannot, it's not like an all day vape flavor for me. But for this one, they decrease the sweetness at least and the berries also less. What you can taste is the yogurt together because all the yogurt flavor is also very rich. Eh? Sometimes you'll feel like, Urgh. but I like yogurt flavor. And also for this one, it's not just yogurt. They add on a little bit of berry taste at the hint, just a little bit hint when you exhale that time. Okay, let's just try one more time. Yes. So inhale the time you feel yogurt taste and exhale the time berry taste like this. Okay. So guys, this is the review for the next gen beep bar. Before I end out these videos, I just gonna tell you all for these videos, I am not promoting. I am not selling as well. All of the reviews is just based on my personal opinion, my hobby, because I'm a vapist. And I don't suggest and don't recommend you all start vaping. Lastly, I don't encourage all the youngsters below than 21 years old to try out this device. And also all the parents out there, please educate your children as well. Thanks for watching these videos. Adios. Ta-da!